If you've been using NetBeans for a little while, you're probably annoyed at this default template that gives you this uh, long comment up here, and it's probably putting your username right here for Windows or maybe Mac. And let's go ahead and do what they suggest here to change it. So to change this template file, choose Tools and then Templates. So Tools is up here, Templates. Now we, most of the files that I'm gonna create are a Java class and occasionally a Java interface. And I'm gonna go to open an editor right here. But if you're using other ones, you probably wanna edit those. Let me make this bigger. Okay, a lot of this stuff you don't wanna change. For example, including the project path by default is super nice and convenient. Uh, but you probably don't need any of these up here. So I'm gonna go ahead and delete that. And if you have extra spaces, you're gonna get extra spaces in your new Java file. All right, so package, oh, and I don't have a license path, so I don't need that. Uh, although I don't think it adds anything to it. So this right here is the username that Windows has, and I wanna change it to my name. This right here, however, you better leave that alone because it's gonna name it after the file. So there are special uh, variables in here. So for example, I just deleted the user special variable and that's totally fine. But if you change this to something different, every new class you make is gonna say public class, whatever you put here. So you wanna be careful, don't change all of these around. And I think that's all I wanna do and I'll hit save. Now I'm gonna, the only way to test this is to make a new Java class. So I'm gonna right click, new Java class. And I'm gonna make interfaces in the future, so I'm going to go change interfaces later, but it's the exact same process. So I make new Java class, I'll call it node, finish. Wow, this looks like a grand success. Well, let's take that out, save it, close and delete node. We're gonna remake it. Perfect, all right. So you, unless you're just using the default package, you probably want package to be included right there, the package that you created it in. You have whatever name you chose, and it should be named right after the name of the file you built. Okay, you do this to interfaces and any other file types that you're creating in NetBeans. And do make sure you save this Java class that you worked on. Close it.